Hey guys, it's Susan back with another tech tip with Language Tech Solutions. Today we're going to be changing our Gmail passwords, making sure that we keep our accounts really secure. The first thing we want to do is go ahead and open up a browser. I'm going to use Firefox for this tutorial, but use whichever browser is your favorite. We're going to type gmail.com into the navigation bar and hit enter. Now, if you have multiple accounts or you're already logged in, um, go ahead and select the account that you want to change the password for and enter your current password when prompted. We're going to click next and that's going to bring up our Gmail dashboard. From this page, we want to navigate to the top menu bar and click on our picture or icon here in the top right corner. This is going to open up a secondary menu. Again, we'll have our other accounts listed, but right now we're just focusing on our primary account. So we'll find the Manage Google Account link and go ahead and click on that. That's going to load your Google Account page. On this page, you have a lot of different options to choose from security, privacy, and personalization. But the main focus that we are looking for today is the security option. So you'll go to this left hand menu, find the security link and click on that icon. There are a lot of security features baked into Gmail, like you can see any recent activity, recent logins, but we're gonna focus right now on our password options. So in this password options box, you'll see that you also have the option to set up phone sign-in or two-step verification. These are nice extras that keep your account super secure. Go ahead and leave a comment if that's something you're interested in seeing a video about. But right now we're focused on a straightforward password update. So we want to find the password option and Google will actually show you the last time that your password was changed. It's a pretty nifty tool. Um, you can see that mine was updated earlier this afternoon. Yours will probably have a date or a month and day here. It's a good rule of thumb to change your business passwords every three to four months and your personal passwords every six months. So this is just a fun feature um, to help you stay on top of that. We're gonna go ahead and click on this passwords bar option to open our password menu. For added security, you might be asked to sign in again. Just enter your current password and click next to load the change password menu. Now you'll want to create a strong password here, which means you don't want to reuse a password that you use for other accounts. We recommend using a password between eight and 12 characters using uppercase letters, lowercase letters, numbers and symbols like the number sign, the dollar sign or a punctuation mark. Once you're satisfied with your password, you'll go down and re-enter it in the confirm new password box. If you're someone who prefers to see what they're typing or you run into an error message about your confirmed password not being the same, you can select one of these eye icons on the right hand side of either box to reveal the text in the box. Once you're satisfied, click change password and you're done. We can scroll down and make sure that our password was changed and this option should be updated with the most recent time change. Thanks for watching. We upload new videos weekly, so make sure that you like and subscribe to stay up to date with all of our tech tips. Leave a comment if there's something you'd like to see us make into a video.